Hi there, it's Shell and Clint. Hey everybody. <laughs> Clint is over yonder. So we're going to do belly bands and uh, I still want to do some other stuff with this before we sew everything in. Uh, I'm still waiting on something. It should be here tomorrow or Tuesday. I can't remember. So I do need that. Before I can finish this journal um, and get it sewn in. So we're going to make some belly bands. Clint did have these pieces and I thought those would be fun. I think I'm actually not a belly band. Uh, fabric, the, the, the fabric flip. So it is Sunday morning. It's pretty early. It's 7.45 or so. so I'm going to see if these, as long as they're under four, I think they'd work. So, yeah, we're going to just kind of, kind of do a little bit more decorating and get it ready for us to start sewing that in. Let me grab my a pair of pinking shears. Oops, I don't know what I dropped. Clint's in the background and he's cleaning. Yay! Trying to find something. Yeah, he's trying to find something, so figured well while he's going through stuff, you know. Can clean, huh? Oh yeah. So I don't know if I've used these on fabric or I have a finger call. I have a brand new pair from huh. Leslie that I need to dig out. Because these aren't very good. Fabric. What? I was just looking to find them. So, and. That is cool. Yeah, save it. So, yeah, Clint's. He's not feeling very good today. He did too much yesterday. Got 72. Yeah, 72 ink. ink blender blanks. So, in the, about in the next week or so, if you're on the list, you'll probably yeah. be receiving a message from us. Yep. So, I think I just like that. Something simple. And then I also have my big box of uh, ribbons, roses. Let's see, what color do I want? Do I want a purple? do have purple. That worked, wouldn't it? Well, that didn't help I could have told you it wasn't in that one. <laughs> Sorry. Funny. I thought so. Yeah, I'm glad you did. Well, go ahead and empty it and put everything in away. Well, I'm going to put everything <laughs> in the break. Like... I'm trying. I'm trying. I know, Suzanne. Can hear her now. Be nice to our Clinton baby. Yeah. You tell him. <laughs> tell him. <laughs> oh, Lord. I know, Suzanne. Oh, uh, let's just wipe this down just to see if there's any. <gasps> Sorry, Clint's moaning in the background. Sorry, guys. The chickens are doing well. It is Sunday, I think I said, and it is. Uh, You'll see this on Tuesday. Kind of ahead of the game, which I really appreciate. This makes life so much easier. Good idea, Gail. <laughs> so, I'm thinking about just kind of putting that there. Just something simple. I'm going to trim this. And, uh, yeah. You guys are doing great. Good. Oh, you beat me to it. I was fixing to do it. Oh, you missed out. Yeah. You can still do it if you want to. No. No, great. <laughs> I don't know. I tell ya. So yeah, um, somebody asked about, hun, if we ever, oh. if we ever had ducks. 
Oh, yeah, we used to. We, had, we did have ducks at one time. We had quite a few of them. They were in our bathtub when they were ducks. Yeah, ducklings. ended up with like 10, I think. And Eight or 10. We live next to a, a Midland Bean, which they also have grain there and beans and stuff. And every morning, the ducks would waddle on over, and it's probably about three, three, four hundred feet. And every morning they'd go over there and they'd call them the girls, those were their girls. And they'd go and clean up all the stuff they spilt on the ground. And yeah, so then later on in the day, they'd come back. They would just wander over there every yeah, morning. Yeah, <laughs> they loved them. <laughs> but I told her that we would tell you guys the story, and that's pretty much the story. They just, um, yeah, you know, eventually critters and stuff got to them and they got old and they passed away, but, yeah, and we really haven't had uh, ducks since that no. time. So it's kind of, I think what I'm going to do is uh, sew this in. I thought about it, but really, I, we don't I have, have a pond. enough chores. Yeah, we don't have a pond or anything, and like you said, there are enough chores here that, there are. I mean, you know, we're both not doing very well in health and all that good jazz, so it's just not something that we want to get back into, having, no, having they, ducks. They were fun and everything, but yeah, it's just too much. That was when we first moved here, so about yeah. tw 23 years ago or so we were going to build this big old pond because we have three acres and never did yeah and then we quite, were we were kind of over it <laughs> yeah it was fun they, they were fun i mean they really were but yeah and the guys next door just loved them oh they did they thought it was so fun for them to visit every day yeah every day they just waddle on over eat their little treats and then they would come home. <laughs> I think they even probably built some just for them too. I think he said they used to feed them and stuff. You yeah, know, I'm sure. Just going to use a straight stitch on this. So just very quickly. Yeah, they were quite the... Quite the characters. Yeah. For sure. But yeah, we would put them in the bathtub. Oh, yeah, they have so much And fun. watch them swim. I have pictures of them swimming in, yeah. in the tub. Country living, I tell you. Oh, yeah. But, yeah, they, they were a joy. We just have decided not to get any more, you know. Yeah. Guess I'll do a zigzag since I have it still on zigzag. I got to sit down. Well, you should sit down. What if you could use an iron? I don't think so. I'm trying to find my uh, embossing this is thing, my jiggy. So, yeah. Clint said he was going to sit down, but now he's walking around. Well, I found this and I wanted to <laughs> make sure that's it. I'm pretty sure that's it. Yep. But our embossing thing was in the bathroom for the longest. And then I think I brought it out here at one time. And now I don't know where I put it. So I still need to organize. So, I mean, pretty simple for this. I did want to glue this down. She's a fabric tech. Yeah, Clint's making tons of racket. You know, you know how he is, though. Try the thing and just put it over it. I get it dry. Mine's free. You know what? Well, you could try it. It's not like you don't have any wood. Oh, that's true. I have to get to try to try it. Yeah, so. Sorry, guys. When he's out here, I don't really focus on what I'm doing because 
you know, he takes up a lot of energy. What are you insinuating, woman? They know. Sorry, it's just coming out so fast. It won't quit. Get on to her, guys. Get on to her. Tell her to be nice to me. I'm always nice to her. Bring her coffee every morning. He does bring me coffee. I'm totally spoiled. I'll be like, honey, can I have coffee? And then he'll run in there and make it for me. Just because I love her. He feels bad if I don't. If I make it myself, he's like, honey. Yeah. Sometimes I will, though, if he's got a critter in his lap or something. Yeah, not very often. It's not the either. same. It's not, no. not loving. I also don't mind. We do for each other. We do. So. Just a one way street. Okay, guys. So, um, was it Leslie? She suggested maybe that I use and I was thinking I'd try that in here. Use some of these um, groups. Put them all, shoved them all in this, in these books. So, as a, uh, these are individuals. I don't want individuals. As a crossway belly band. A what? So, belly band that goes crosswise. You mean diagonal? Yeah, that. Yeah, I read that. Who said that? Ow. I think it was Leslie, wasn't it? Oh, that's who. Yeah, it was Leslie. <coughs> so, Leslie, let's try that because mm -hmm. I think that would be cute in here. Reading the comments, I think a lot of people are kind of disappointed that there's not Well, that they're smaller huge. Ones. I mean, I don't know. You know, kind of, as a junk journaler, they're really, really big. Yeah, I think it's something. And I don't think things. I would use it in a scrapbook, and I've done a lot of scrapbooking in my time. Yeah. True. So I don't know. I don't think I want that one. So I'm just trying to figure out how I want to use it in here. I felt like these girls wouldn't that be cute to have butterfly wings coming from the from outside? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I think I might do that, but I'm gonna to gonna kind of look. I like to watch your work. You like to watch. Well, I like your create, watch your creativity, and I guess how you you know. I think I mix these up because I have some, so I'm gonna have to rearrange them. But so far, I really like those those little girls. Maybe that's what I should just stick to. Clint's one of those who he looks stuff do you guys have or are you like that where you're like I looked everywhere for this and I go outside and find it it's aggravating you all get out to me and I look <laughs> too and I move crap and just come out I look over where I'm looking for. he was panicking last week honey we can't find the driver's license I said well they were in the oh glove box hun so go look in the glove box go look in the glove box oh I already looked I took everything out everything out and looked they're right. not in there. They were in there. Cool. So I went out there and I just reached in and grabbed them. I'm like, okay, it's okay. You didn't lose them. I didn't lose them. Because I was thinking, uh oh, I lost them. But no, he just didn't look. I looked. Just apparently he missed them. Found one thing, though. What did you find? Found a remote. Oh, is that for the thing? Yep. Oh. She probably needs that. Yeah, we'll do no good without it. Those are kind of cute too. Well, Let's see if those work. will work. That's because you're not looking in the right place. Well, I think that would be too too wide, don't you? But look at these butterfly wings. I think I want to stick with these guys over here. Maybe we'll color them. Uh, too fun. Such a fun idea, Leslie. Pretty sure it was her. I, I was thinking like something like that. You know, and kind of make them little butterfly girls. I think this one's too big. Not really. That would actually work nicely. So we'll have to play with that and see. 
You don't want them the same color, do you? No, you don't. These are big butterflies, too, that, you know, I just don't think about using. And, I mean, because they're so big. That would work. And if I left the butterfly on the back, it would kind of add some stability to it. That's cute. Okay, maybe we'll do that. So let me grab my Copics and just see. Which way are you walking? Hey, here, why? What do you need? Oh, I was going to have you grab my well, Copics. Tell me where they are. Right there, see them? Oh, in that tan thing? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I tell you guys, but all the chicks are doing well. Yeah. Seem to be doing well. I was going to bring one in. I might in a little bit, but I was just waiting for it. The heater wasn't up, so I didn't want to make it too cold. Oh, what wasn't up? What? The oh, heater in, wasn't too In here, right? Yeah, so I didn't want to bring it in. I think I might use black and kind of go around the edge. I'll find it after a while when I'm going through everything that you just went through. Good for you, dear. <laughs> I did ask him, though, if he could climb up and put yeah. some stuff up top for me if he feels like it. Well. Just to get rid of. Because so I have a bunch of stuff down below that just needs to get out of here. I'm just cut, covering, coloring this with black. Kind of get rid of that. And you know, I could um, cut this off, but I know, you know, I don't know. We'll, we'll try it and see. But I do definitely want the edges black. Just makes it look nicer. And then that. I like that. What do you think? Yeah. Kind of like a bu butterfly wing since it's a butterfly journal. Yeah. yeah. Inspired by Miss Leslie. Cut those buttons out too. Oh, okay. Yeah. They're not quite the right for well, this journal, more, I don't think. I think but more childish or yeah, they whatever are. the word would be. Ooh. Childlike. That would be. guys been up to this week and well this will be Tuesday so probably I think we have to go downtown gotta go Tuesday and we gotta take the baby chickens so then we might have the contest the yeah we'll probably store them tomorrow we'll have a house naming contest house naming chicken naming contest yeah we found out that well, you guys cracked me up. The tail feathers, the females, their tail feathers grow out first. And we really want more, more female females than, and you know, than males. Yeah. Because, yeah, you guys know. So. I think I will put, leave this on the back. And then just kind of position it. And these are short enough, I think, that I could still... Two, three, four. Hope. I hope it's short enough. Let's see. I was just going all out, and then I'm like, uh oh, I hope these would fit. Let's put this in the other signature. That'd be a nice. Oh, you already did it. I think that would fit, even if it kind of pokes out a little bit. We could even take it down a little bit more. Do what? That'd have been a nice flip for your wood girl. Yep, but too late. late. Too late. I am going to cut this. I know, I know. We might can still use them. Who knows? 
I have so many of these because I buy them and then I never use them because they're so big. So maybe put them together a little bit closer like that. Yeah, let's put that one right there. Yeah, Clint got 72 done. Some of those are the cedar ones. Yeah, I got so. five cedars. And you know what I didn't do yet is go around her. But five cedar yesterday. I did five. 26 aspen and five cedars yesterday. Yep. I was so beat. Takes it out again, I ain't gonna worry about that. I don't remember what it looked like. <laughs> yeah, that, I think. Sometimes I do use markers to trim it out. Oh, is it over there, hon? Where? Straight up in front of you. On the floor or on top? On the counter. No, it's not there. Never mind. You mean that black thing? No, I was thinking that was one. I was putting some stuff up oh. there, so I didn't know. But yeah, this just makes them look more put together. And when it, if you're using a marker, then you want to do it on the back so that if your hand slips like that, it doesn't mess up the picture. Just a little tip. I think you need to go in the house and rest. I don't want to be out here with you. <laughs> yeah, but you sure are sighing and stuff a lot. I know. I know. I need to stay on my knees. It's just hard for me to do that. There. Gonna go get his chicken to stroke in a minute. Chicken. Okay, let it dry for just a second. But I do want to like add some color to the girls. So I'm thinking like maybe red and orange. Maybe this orange though. Or like a Tuscan orange. He has the shadows and stuff with his Copics. You can kind of just draw and the shadows will still come through. I'm going to make sure I get her outfit correct. Yes, dear. Just checking. It's kind of fun. I mean, instead of just using the black and white, it's kind of fun to have the Copic. You can use whatever you'd like, but Copic are alcohol markers. So they actually are really nice to for this because they don't really rub off. <laughs> what? Oh, Suzanne, are those Clint Baby's new scissors? No, Clint's scissors are not in the studio. No, Suzanne. mine are on my table in the living room. So even though I know you think that that I would steal them, which you know I wouldn't. <laughs> okay, I might. But she would do. See, that's kind of cute. Let's add some flowers. So I kind of like that, just the dress. 
And then this one will do yellow, if I can find a good yellow. Right, yeah. I mean, don't go out and buy any Copics if you don't. There are, um, they're unnecessary, I think, for junk darling. But, and they're like $5 each. I was gonna say, they're not really a cost effective. They're right. not. And there are other alcohol markers that are just as effective, that are much cheaper. That I, if I was, you know, doing it again, I got them when I was doing carbs. And I got them like off eBay, so somebody was selling their, their stuff. And, you know, so I've had them for many, many, many years. One person was like, I'm selling all my stuff. So I got them for pretty inexpensively. Um, but, like I said, I do like it for this, you know. the Now her... You're just not going to really see it, huh? Oh, you're coloring your... What do you color? Oh, you colored their dresses. Yeah, to kind of match their little wings. That's but like this idea. one doesn't have her, um, she's not going to have any wings showing. Well, all you need is the little tiny piece right there, don't you? Just, just a wing. I was head. thinking that, too. Just a little one. That's her. They could be conjoined triplets. <laughs> That's one reason I didn't put, because I was thinking of that, and I thought, well, I could cut this one off. But I don't want them conjoined. No. Looking just kind of bizarre to me. Yeah, you wouldn't see the first girls. What do you mean? The first second wing on the first girl. No, you wouldn't. So yeah, maybe I'll look and see if I have like a blue or something, because I think a blue would really make it pop. But since I have the butterfly ladies, this was such a good idea. I think this was Leslie's idea, hon. Do you remember? What you know what? We could even that? trim her. Uh-oh. Oh, sorry, head sneeze. <laughs> I was going to see if I had a blue butterfly. And that's because I could just trim off, like Clint said, just trim off a little bit. Hey, you don't need very much. Really just a little tiny bit. Is that all the butterflies I have? Uh, green? You want green? Green's huge though, isn't he? I would like a different color though. I thought I saw more on this side, maybe not. Was that over on the other page? No. Yeah, but it's not blue. Oh, I see. I mean, I could do the green and like trim it, but I mean, you're not yeah, even going to see why it. I didn't but like do. that, you could, you know, work her wings are like behind her. Yeah, because the other gals would be behind, so you wouldn't see this one, you wouldn't see that one. You only need to see that little tiny bit. Yeah, you'd only need to see that little tiny bit. We could do that. Let's do that. I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm going to cut it off. <laughs> this oh. one maybe we can use. Because I was thinking, if I like it, I could do a belly band on the other side too. So you know what? Let's just pop these out. The colors I would like to use on the other side. Maybe that one, and maybe that one. Look. See if we can make it work. And then, look, I can buy more butterflies. Just kidding. Just kidding. And then, of course, I could have used, you know, like a from, yeah. from the kit. But these are so sturdy, and since it's going to be a belly band, yeah, you don't want it to fall apart. I kind of wanted it to stay together, yeah. So let's do the black. I'm not going to see much of the green, but hmm. because it is kind of on a slick surface, it takes a little bit to, to dry. These are permanent too, so. But yeah, if you're looking for some alcohol markers, let me know or go check out um, Lindsay Wyrick's. She suggests some really inexpensive, um, not the frugal, the frugal crafter. crafter. She, yeah, she suggests some of those. So 
that are really inexpensive but they do just as well I think or would for you know just to get to do a little bit of coloring here and there I was thinking oh I should get those but I already have all these and I can make these work but they're really inexpensive some of the, the ones that she suggests Yeah, I kind of wanted a color, you know, a brighter color in the center. Kind of pretty. And we'll just put green in her hair. That's cute. I am so glad you suggested that, Miss Leslie. cute idea. Oh, I love it. What do you guys think? Okay, and then this one, like Clint said, will go right, maybe right there, so we'll have green there and green there. So we'll put a little bit of Look at us being creative today. And Suzanne, look, I'm being creative with Clint today. She was like, you did that without Clint. <laughs> yeah, I read that. <laughs> oh, she's so funny. She's hilarious. Okay. Oh, I love it. What do you guys think? So let's go back behind it and we, I want to glue all these little pieces down pretty good because since they're going to be our belly band you know I don't want things getting stuck on them. Uh, sorry I got, I wiped my face and then I got glue all over my face. That's how I roll. my brother wrote this morning he's like my foot hurts and you know he has all those feet problems because of his diabetes and I'm like well go to the hospital then he says no and then I'm like well you know if you're not going to do anything about it then why are you complaining to me FYI <clears throat> oh my gosh guys hon what do you think it was good isn't that fun okay we're going to make another one because I just love incorporating these now, now that I did the first one. Okay, so we're going to put it in this one back here, maybe on this page. Oh, I love it. You know what I think? I think I'm going to put it on a, like a strip, maybe a green strip of paper. Let me go grab something. Oh, wait. Here's some, um, this. We'll just put it on that, you know, just something to go across. So, got my cutter. And then, let's do like four and a half, I think. I just want the wood part. So it's a little bit bigger. I just want to make sure that it's going to be big enough. That'll go with the rest of the book. I should have done just, should have just stuck to it, huh? This one is so fun. We're gonna make another one just because I like it so much.
sorry Clint's flying in the background. Instead of sitting down, he's wandering throughout the out the room. Sorry. You know how <laughs> hard it is for me. I don't have to think totally. I keep thinking, well, could it be in there? Could it be here? Could it be there? I wonder if I should sew this, man. Nah, it'll be fine with that art glitter glue. <laughs> I'm not going to listen to you. Well, so. I'm listening to you. I've been sitting here. You don't see anything? What's that down there? Nothing. Nothing. Why don't you pick up all that stuff there and put it in a box? I'm just kidding. Oh, I love it. What do you guys think? <laughs> Leslie, let, let me know because this was totally inspired by you. friend from Arizona, which I'm getting over into Arizona sometime in the next year or so. I have so many friends over there. That yeah, you really do, don't you? Dear? I do. I have, yeah. Yeah, you and Charlotte will have to go. Yeah, me and Charlotte or me and Sis or some somebody. Clint's going to be like, I'm too busy. I don't want to go. Well, I am. Yeah, but you wouldn't be too busy. If Mom would come down... I still have to work. Not if you... If it was two years from now and you weren't... Well, that's different. I mean, it doesn't have to be like tomorrow. I mean... Leslie, when I come, can I stay with you? We just have to fly. I don't know if I could drive. Okay, what's going on? Hold on. Is it really tight? Trying to figure out what I'm doing here. Okay, it's too tight or something. Uh, let me find a larger tag. There we go. I was gonna start using it, but you can have it. I'm just going to leave that there so I remind myself to put something in there. What do you guys think? I love it! Okay, let's make another one for the other. The other side. Because, you know, we can. Okay, that was too fun. So now I want those all throughout the book. <laughs> Honey, I'm out of butterflies. Okay. looking through these little pieces. Yeah, and I think I have, I know I have a, um, a thing that Leslie sent me that has a lot of storage in it. So I was thinking, because look at this one. It wasn't this one. The other one, though, is so big and bulbous now, so I need to move them. Couldn't you, couldn't you make a soft cover like mine, the expandable one? Wouldn't yeah. that work good for it? it? Probably would, yeah. Do you need me to make you one? Yeah, I do. You can do it right now if you want. That ain't gonna happen. Besides, I ain't got nothing out here. You got everything out here, don't you? Uh uh. But that is a good idea. Yeah, it is. These little girls. They look all dressy, but they look fun, happy as butterflies. I'm just so excited now. Okay. Oh, look at these. Oh, those are I think this is a little boy, though, is it? It is, yeah. Yeah, because it has the little bloomers. They look cute, but... Not for my butterfly people. So that box underneath your thing is good stuff. Oh, it could be in there. Cardboard box. Hold on, let me grab the cardboard box for my honey. For my honey bunny. What? Okay, guys, I do have these butterflies, huh. too. I forgot about. 
So I used those a couple of years ago in a butterfly journal. Don't you have some small people you could put butterfly wings behind? Oh, and I have these butterfly wings. You know what? Butterflies, huh? What about using smaller people with butterfly wings? Yeah, I could. I was just thinking of a uh, another belly band kind of thing. Yeah. Though, I mean, I don't have to. I could make like a tag with a belly band person behind it. I mean, a butterfly thing behind it. Yeah. See, all these I just kind of showed in here, but I think they're all individuals. But I might come across a cute little individual that needs some wings. So those are the ones you just got, right? Yeah. And like somebody else was saying, you know, it would be nice if he used different people because like this one is in that other set, you know, the one that that we get all the time. And I, come to think of it, somebody did send me a whole bunch of these. <laughs> They're up here too, but I haven't organized them. So, but these are like the groups. But yeah, it would be nice if he, uh, I think it was Robin who said it would be nice if he kind of use different people. Well, yeah, because you get tired of using the same Well, the people. same people, and so everybody has the, um, wouldn't that be funny with the butterfly wings on them? Oh, that would be. I don't know. I don't know. That's kind of funny. But I might try it. Just would you have any manly wings? You could probably um, make some manly. Butterfly wings are a manly or not. It's kind of like ladybugs. Don't you guys think I mean, ladybugs are male and female. Yeah, of course. That's what I would think. Oh, look at her, though. Wouldn't she be precious with a pair of wings on her? Yep. Let's put her over there. These are solos. She'd be cute with wings on, too. Some solos. That's why I wasn't sure if I mixed and matched my solos and my groups. But I think it'd be funny to do the men too, but I could decorate throughout the book with those other ones, with those little girls. That she would be, be cute hilarious. too. She'd be cute. She'd be cute. <laughs> I love all these little critters. People, I should say. Oh, and look at them. Wouldn't they be cute with wings? <laughs> okay, yeah, here's some. See, I do have some groups in here. Let's see, should be cute. Yeah, but they. I mean, I suppose there's like a. They'd be cute. I suppose there is. A, they would be cute. I think they're too dressy. Like, what was I thinking? Like these people, they look kind of elderly. I'm surprised. I'm. I suppose there's elderly uh, butterflies, right? So really, you could use any anything you wanted to. But I'm just saying, just me thinking out loud. Well, that makes it a challenge. It does make it a challenge. You know how to make this look. Yeah. But wouldn't these guys be cute with butterfly oh wings? God, that'd be hilarious. Look at me. See, what I would do is I'd cut it down the center and then reposition it so that the wings are closer together or in a more suitable fashion. <laughs> what? Aren't those awesome? Oh, that's just too funny. That's I like them. Well, I think they're neat. I didn't say that, but they're fun. Yeah, let's do it. Why not, huh? I'm going to cut this one, too. This is what I do when I'm doing my digitals. I cut them apart on, in the, um, in the thing. I think we'll use these because I already pulled these. And then you can position the wings as you'd like them to be. Kind of like, um, What's the guy on It's a Wonderful Life, Clarence? Clarence Angel? Yeah, he gets his wings, you know, so. Yeah. You could be thinking we could call this guy Clarence. 
I don't know, I think it's adorable. Got a little, little heavy handed there. Hope you guys like this one. This is a fun little, definitely challenging. When she said that, I was like, oh, what a great idea. And then I was thinking, oh, let's make them in butterflies. <laughs> do this part first and I'll just start drying. I thought you were sitting down. Honey, I was. I just looked at something. I thought I need to go check it out. Oh. I did look where we had them. In the bathroom. For some reason they ended up in the where my hair dryer is. I should look again though because I don't think I looked today. No, you probably should Clint looked earlier. <laughs> Didn't you? Shut up. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Bite me, woman. Uh, what? What? That girl's having fun at her retreat. She was so looking forward to it. I like to understand why. Yeah, it's kind of fun to get away from your husband for a little bit. You know, I don't even take this abuse, woman. <laughs> I wasn't talking about you, I was talking about Gail. Uh huh. Well, no, baby, I know better. <laughs> I can't believe I don't know where it is. Like I said, I would have thought I would have put it in here. Where? In one of these drawers. Well, that's what I thought too. So that I would be all organized and Betty would have been proud of me, but... but yeah, I mean, you're never... Unless it's in the very bottom, but I don't think I would have put it down there. takes a little bit of time for them to dry. I mean, it's pretty large to hide on, you know. Well, I know. That's why I think it wouldn't be that bloody hard to find a dumb thing. I know. Well, somehow you put it up on top. No, I wouldn't. Well, I went, by accident. I went through everything, though, even as I was putting it on top and everything, because yeah. I was like, yeah. not climbing back up here. No, that's what I'm sure. My people freak out when I'm my people freak out when I'm climbing on top. <laughs> Though I figured if I fell down I could set the um set the recorder to go back and forth so it would look like I was falling down and jumping up and falling down oh. and jumping up. They they weren't that thrilled with that either. But, you know. Okay, so let's see how we want to do this. This guy, his wings, <laughs> isn't he cute? Okay, you know what I forgot? Go around the guys. Again, you want to come from the back. This is really prevalent in uh, card making. They always, you know, when you fuzzy cut anything out, I always go around it because it kind of hides any mistakes, that kind of thing. Well, I'll find it this week. and We need it for the front of the cover, in case you guys were wondering. 
my heat tool. I'm trying to think. You don't have it out in the porch, do you? No. I think I'm, when we used it last. I'll go, I'm going to go outside and get the background. Uh, I think it's out of here. I'm going to go out and get get my long time when he's napping. Sometimes. <coughs> okay, so they're so great. I love them. Do I want or do I want the yellow over here? I don't think it really matters, does it? See, then you can kind of overlap it if it fits better. Kind of like it hanging like that. And then this guy, I'm just trying to, does he look like, yeah, let's do that. <laughs> oh, I cracked myself up. What do you think, Leslie? Is this what you had in mind when you said, make them into belly bands? <laughs> Put the old butterfly wings on them, Michelle. I know you didn't say that part, but that's how I interpreted it. Then we'll put his wing. Kind of like that. That's why they have to sit further apart because their wings are touching. The wings are bugging each other. Don't want to crush them. Isn't that cute? I love it. I know. They're men. Manly butterflies. And we'll put him something like that. One of them does? Yeah. Did you clean it? I found it. Where was it? In the bathroom? Still? In the bathroom, but it was on the laundry thing. Oh. In your okay. hair cutting thing. Oh. Of all places. Wow. And you found it there. That's yeah. good. There's some reason I thought, I need to look right here. How far is that? Oh, that's about four and a half. What do you guys think? They're so awesome. I know. I'm being, being weird today. But look, see all this black, it probably will still be on my fingers tomorrow and the next day. It's really hard to get this stuff off. So don't be touching anything, Michelle. Let's see, where do we want that? Oh, I'm having so much fun. Should we put it on this page? That's kind of cool. It kind of melds it out a little. I think we'll have him over a little. Oh my gosh. I love it. What do you guys think? Don't you just love that? Okay. Let's do the wood piece again, because why not? Oh. Let's see. I was thinking, because, you know, they need to, like, sit on it, so you need it to be
they're sitting on a uh, bench or something. Okay. Put what in? Uh, the critters? Yeah. Oh, did you get them? Right there? Where's that one box? Right there? That was an empty box. Oh. Well, here. Here they come. Here's one Miss, of them. Miss Glennis. You go, Glennis. Can't see it. Oh, here. I don't want it because what if it poops on my thing? Oh, it just wipes right off. Then I have to wash it and stuff. There you go, Glennis. Um, about a week old now, I guess. Oh. Oh, oh he's not goodness. happy. He's not happy about you. Uh-oh. Yep. Oh, yeah. Dang it. Clint didn't use enough oil on it. Took us. Yeah. Oh, I love it. I'm going to leave it like this right now. I'm going to go grab that. Other okay, one. don't let any cats in. Just keeping. Make sure it's not hopping out or anything. Okay, I'm having way too much fun, aren't I? Oh, here, here for it. Look at them. What do you guys think? I love them. And I do have enough butterflies, I think, to continue to create, like, for different things. Just to make sure. See, that one goes through just fine. Let's glue this together. Herpes in the background. Daddy went inside. Okay, what I'm thinking about is their outfits. I do want to kind of touch it up a little bit just to kind of bring it together. I want this one for his shirt. <laughs> I know, Chirpy. Chirpy. And then we'll put this on his hat. Okay, it's still still in there. It's not not going anywhere. So we'll bring in the green. Where's that other green that I had? A little bit darker, so we'll do this tie green. I heard him jumping. I was like, oh, oh, he jumped out. But he didn't. Sorry, guys. If you're, if that's annoying, we are on a farm. And that's just what we do. We have critters everywhere. Oh, I love it, guys. Okay. And some yellow or orange. Let's do this one. His and yellow too, because he has a little bit of yellow. Yellow hat. But when he sat for this picture, he didn't think, oh, somebody will make me into a butterfly someday. But here we are. Here we are. And maybe just a touch of. Let's do this darker orange for his tie. Just to give it some. Loud, I'm in here by myself. What do you guys think? I love it. So fun. <laughs> I'm having a blast. I'm having a blast, guys. Okay. I think we're going to go ahead and wrap it up. Um, 
So we did the belly band, I mean the fabric clip, two belly bands, one here, <laughs> I love them, oh, they're so fun, and then we did one in the back, and I want to show you, did I show you guys the, the stuff? I think it'll be okay because you have the red light out there. Yeah, that's true. Come on. So I love that, that shimmery, Gwendolyn inspired little butterfly idea. And then our other one is here, which I think is precious. I love that. Isn't that fun? Where did that thing come from? Sorry, it's a piece of hair. Oh, I tell you. Okay. So guys, oh, I had so much fun. So I think in tomorrow's video, we're going to sew, oh no, I can't sew the signatures. I still have one more thing that I really want to put in here, but I'm waiting on some pieces for that. And then we'll sew them together. But thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this little take on uh, Leslie's idea. She's probably thinking, oh my gosh, Michelle, I did not have that idea. <laughs> yeah, you did. It inspired it in me. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure and hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. And we will see you guys in the next video. See you soon. Bye.